And from our New Mexico mobile newsroom, fireworks don't just glow and sparkle while they come with beauty. They also come with danger. With 4th of July just a couple of days away, the tips you need to know to avoid a trip to the hospital. ABC 7's Sarah Coria reports on the celebrations and how to do it safely. Sponsored by Diablo Fireworks. It is dangerous. Um, every year we have accidents where uh, there's burns to the body, burns to the hands. Sunland Park Fire Chief Danny Medrano set up this demonstration showing us the dangers of fireworks. Last 4th of July, his department was called out to five firework-related injuries that all required hospitalization. There's enough gunpowder in there to actually uh, burn through flesh and actually break bones. According to the Mayo Clinic, hands and fingers are the most commonly injured parts of the body. They account for about 31% of cases. These types of injuries often occur when people hold lit fireworks. We get people who try to hold a firework in their fist. Common fireworks like sparklers are often assumed safe for children. Kids should never ignite fireworks. Here's why. Check out how sparklers burned this chicken and hot dog. Just like that, they can also burn people's hands and arms. Different fireworks are burned at different uh, temperatures, but they're well over 1,000 degrees. Um, uh, human skin starts to burn at about 130 degrees, give or take. Um, so you can imagine that instantaneous uh, uh, ignition or combustion of a firework will immediately burn the skin. We've seen a destruction of hands. Uh, hair catching fire, clothing catching fire. Eye wounds account for about 14% of firework related injuries. They're caused by the gunpowder, sulfur and charcoal that make up most fireworks. To avoid firework injuries, never throw or point fireworks toward people, animals, vehicles, structures or flammable materials. Always follow the instructions on the packaging. Have a bucket of water close by. Wear eye protection. Light only one firework at a time and never relight a dud. Never light sparklers or fireworks indoors. Store fireworks in a cool, dry place away from children and pets. And if you are impaired by alcohol, don't use fireworks. Sarah Coria, ABC7.